So here we are again. I'm on this reaction roller coaster here. And I'll get them scheduled out after I get them down on um, the Filmora editing software. So going through the list, um, I could name off a bunch of people, but I know there was a lot of you that requested uh, this next song, which I haven't even heard yet. Surprisingly, I've been on this journey for 11 months now, and um, next month we will be going on one year. So the name of this one is Wish I Had an Angel. This is End of Era, and this was recorded at Hartwell Arena in October of 2005. The significance of this particular song, and I want to say it was the last performance that... Uh, the song they did in the set, and I might be wrong, so don't quote me on that, but um, is that after this, uh, Taria was dismissed from the group via an open letter, which I know there's a lot of thoughts and controversy and wounds on that, um, as I've been learning about Nightwish and, and how people feel, um, about this particular thing. I think that what we can do though is take it into our hearts that over time things happen and they play out in life with a, a reason and purpose as we would see that would be the best choice at the time. Was it the right choice? Was it the wrong choice? Sometimes we don't know until later on but the beauty of it is this, they have their moments, they're captured in time, and they were there for a reason and purpose. Um, and we live and we learn, we move on, right, wrong, indifferent, that's just the way it is. So um, let's do this. Let's get on to this one. Um, Let's pay close attention to their um, their uh, body language, and uh, I just want to see a little bit, get a feel for it. End of Era is a very special um, tour, and uh, let's get this one going. Okay, I wish I had an angel. So are we ready for this one? Here we go. Wish I had a
I decided to go ahead and watch the end of this. And yes, I was right. I wish I had an angel um, was the final performance for this particular venue and this particular tour. Um, and some of it was very familiar to me, even though I hadn't heard the song. I did take excerpts from the final portions of this for the camera work when I put together my very first edited um, uh, Poet in the Pendulum. Now, I did that a number of months ago. It was done on the laptop. Looking back, I really wish I'd had the better quality, but um, that's okay, we're here now. Anyway, so some of it I did recognize as part of the camera angles that I used for that particular um, reaction and commentary that I did. Um, I noticed during the performance, Thomas's uh, head was down quite a bit. He was very much into it. Um, the spoken singing part for Marco is he has, like I said, his voice kind of lends itself to that kind of eerie, you know, he gets those uh, very colorful character type things. Um, very intense and was done that way. Um, I loved the way Impu was very busy during this. He was different places, um, but uh, I think quite profound was the uh, watching the audience and um, knowing that that was the end of that particular tour. But um, you know, it would be the end of more than just that. But an end always has a beginning somewhere. So anyway, wish I had an angel.